So Hunga spreading grounds and other spreading grounds like it are, are critical for the future of the city's water supply. LADWP and the Los Angeles County Flood Control District are working together on the Tahunga Spreading Grounds Enhancement Project. The improved spreading grounds will capture more stormwater and help enhance local water supplies. This facility behind me is roughly over one acre and could fill up to 10 feet deep. That is enough to supply 30 single-family homes per year. There are currently 20 similar basins of varying sizes at Tahunga Spreading Grounds. The spreading basins are like football field-sized bowls that capture stormwater before they percolate into the natural aquifer below and recharge the groundwater. The project will reconfigure the current 20 bowls into 10 deeper basins, vastly increasing the stormwater capture capacity. Every time it rains, we need more capacity to put that rainwater into the ground. But we need to get water into the San Fernando Valley groundwater aquifer, then it can become groundwater supply that our wells will pull out and treat and deliver to all the residents. The Tahunga Spreading Grounds sit on a 150-acre site in Sun Valley at the intersection of Interstate 5 and CA 170, right on top of the San Fernando groundwater aquifer. We're looking to really turn toward local water resources and not have so much reliance on imported water. And so part of the plan is to be able to produce more local groundwater, but we have to get water into the ground for the future. By increasing the size of the spreading basins, the project will double the facility's recharge capacity. On a year that LA gets the average average amount of rain it usually gets. The spreading ground will collect up to 5 billion gallons of water each year to recharge the groundwater basin annually. This is enough water to sustain approximately 48,000 homes all year. LADWP also invests in smaller scale street level stormwater capture projects that have multiple side benefits. They minimize local flooding if, if there is flooding on the streets. They uh, provide the community open space and they generally beautify the community with native vegetation, open space, and wildlife. Beautification is also a part of the Tahunga Spreading Grounds Enhancement Project's overall objective. Aside from recharging the aquifer, the renovation will allow for passive recreation on community open space. 